Welcome to this short video all about learning to blow your flute and producing a sound using just your head joint. First things first, we're going to get our lips right. So I'd like you to put your lips together as if you're bored. So we're just pulling down at the sides here. And then we're just going to make the sound so that our lips stay more or less together. And when we do that, we get a very small hole and it directs the air perfectly for us. That's really important that that hole's small. If the hole's big, you'll be like the wind and the air's gonna go all over the place and you're not gonna get that lovely sound that we're looking for. Breathing wise, again, if we've got this right, the breathing should follow. So we're gonna take our Peter pointer finger and you're going to put that across here. And when we breathe out, the air's gonna go across your finger. So we're gonna breathe in through our nose and we're going to count to four and then we're going to breathe out through our very small aperture so we get this lovely long sustained sound. Okay, ready? In. And. Fabulous. Let's do that again. Okay, we're going to go breathe in for four. One. Wonderful. The next thing we're going to do after that is get our head joint. So if you pause the video, so on your head joint, you'll notice that this is called the lip plate. This side is wider than this side. This side is thinner and this side is wider. And it's the wide side that's gonna sit in this divot in your chin. It's really important that it sits in your chin and isn't too far away. And when you bind your lip, the hole has to point to the sky. If your lip is turned in like that, and make a very very weak sound so this hole has to be pointing towards the ceiling and that's very very important same thing we're going to breathe in through our nose for four counts and then out through our lips and hopefully we're going to get a really nice sound you ready so sad lips and breathe in and let's do that again breathe in Don't worry if you can't breathe out across your flute for those four counts. One count, two count, that's absolutely fine. But it's really important that you don't gasp for air. Because if you're doing this, you're going to very, very quickly run out of breath. You might go dizzy and you're certainly not getting a lovely sound out of that flute. So let's do it one more time. Hold the breath going out for as long as you can. You might be able to do it for longer than four seconds. If you can, fantastic. And your lip, sad lips, small hole. And breathe in. And wonderful. If you're struggling, press stop, go back to the beginning of the video and do that breathing again. The other thing you can do at home is in a mirror and watch yourself. Make sure you're getting these lips. Make sure that that hole is pointing to the ceiling and you're not covering it. And make sure that your breathing is really, really steady and you're not just huffing and puffing and trying to blow that house down. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Watch out for more from me. In the next one, we're going to be learning about the different sounds we can make with this head joint. Thank you. Thank you very much. Have fun. Bye.